my YouTube fam, it's your girl Kiana and welcome back to Kiana's Creative Closet, my loves. Um, today we're going to be doing a fall haul. Um, Y'all just don't understand how um, happy I am for fall. Fall is my one of my favorite months, fall and spring. Um, and I just love fall fashion. I think fall fashion um, is just out of this world because you can still mix kind of your warm weather items with your kind of cool or cold weather items you just have to layer up so I love that um you should notice by the description box that this is going to be a Shein haul um Shein has been putting out some very um some awesome items this fall season um Shein has also launched their um is it luxury or it's kind of like their high-end collection they don't have it in plus size um, right now, I'm hoping that they will be coming out with more of a luxury line for the plus size um, part of the website. Um, just because we deserve better quality as well. But even though these items did not come from that new um, brand that they're offering now, um, I think these pieces, the pieces that they have um, brought us for the fall season um, are pretty awesome. I have some pieces here. I'm sorry, my pieces are over here, so that's why I'm looking there. Um, I have some pieces that are of very awesome quality. Quality is very sturdy, very thick, very good. And then I have a few items that um, I did get in this haul that um, the you know the material wasn't what I expected or what I wanted what would have wanted it to be. But either way, um, I'm going to show you everything that I picked up. Um, I have not shopped, well I only shopped with Shein, well I think I did two orders um, this spring kind of summer season. Um, I don't really frequent Shein a lot, but I want to get more into it. I know a lot of you shop at Shein, I know a lot of you shop at Boohoo, so I want to kind of get some of those websites on my channel. I want to be able to be diverse. Instead of just showing you H&M items all the time or Target items um, or kind of like higher end brands like Eloquy, um, I do want to get into some of the lower brands for people who do shop um, with Shein or Boohoo. I think I'm going to be purchasing some items from Boohoo pretty soon. I've been looking. I just haven't been able to find anything. Um, well, anything worth a haul. But let's jump into this Shein haul. But before we do so, if you are new here and you love fashion like your girl does, please feel free to subscribe down below. If you are already a subscriber of mine, welcome back my loves and thanks for the support. I need all of you to turn on your notifications so you can be notified of my up and coming videos or whenever I post something new. Um, so yeah, oh, one more thing you guys, um, please, feel, please feel free and please like this video. It really helps me out when you like the video when you comment or when you share this video but I will be so appreciative if you do like the video all right let's jump into it okay my loves before I start with the clothing items I want to show you a couple of accessories that I picked up um, I've been wanting to kind of broaden my range of um, jewelry. I don't wear much jewelry. You always see me with the same K necklace, which surprisingly I'm not wearing today. Um, but I just wanted to, you know, broaden my jewelry um, collection. I don't have any necklaces here today, but I did pick up a few earrings. Um, the first pair are these here. I hope that this is focusing, focusing well. But they are gorgeous. These are a pair of like rainbow, um, not studs, but hanging kind of um, chandelier earrings. And they are in so um, many beautiful colors. We have pink, we have purple, yellow, blue. Um, these are awesome, you guys. Um, these would be so perfect. Now, um, I've been picking up a lot of um, bright colors this spring season so those will be perfect to wear now um, the next pair I'm going to show you are these here I hope that it's focusing and the light is not dragging out the color but they're just a beautiful pair of like um, painters earring and they're kind of stood I like small earrings so I think these are perfect 
um, their gold and they have a little bit of pink and purple and blue. Um, I love gold accessories and I think this would be perfect for my style, the type, the style of jewelry that um, I love. So the next one, you guys, are so gorgeous and they are these. I love, love, love these earrings, you all. Now, we all know that blue, um, that blue, um, is in, again, this spring, I mean, not spring, I'm sorry, fall season. We had blue, um, last fall and winter, and blue is definitely going to be in. And I've been seeing a lot of this color. This is gorgeous. It has the blue jewels, and it has the gold undertone. It's a larger kind of hanging earring um i normally don't wear larger earrings but i think this is something very pretty to dress up just a simple outfit so i picked these up as well and okay, the next thing i'm going to show you is not um earrings it's just bracelets now i normally don't um wear bracelets i don't have many bracelets at all i tend to go with my um watch i have a gold michael kors watch i wear that all the time but that's getting pretty old so i decided to pick up um this bracelet here and i hope it's focusing um yeah and i think it's really pretty it's the stretchy type of jewelry it's kind of like charm style bracelets i want to get more of like the thinner line um bracelets like this just so i can stack them but this was probably only about three dollars so i said why not give it a try okay, so the first clothing item that i'm going to show you are these camel color leather pants that i picked up from shein um and i was just so um infatuated with these pants on the website they looked very nice on the model but i'm not sure now that i have them in they're just a camel straight um leg leather or faux leather pant they have the elastic in the waistband they do have belt loops so you can put a belt through this um it has a tortoiseshell um budding and they zip up what i don't like about these pants is they have no pockets and i noticed none of the pants that i picked up today have pockets i do not like that i'm used to putting my hands in my pockets it's a lot even when i have on dresses i prefer a dress that had pockets but definitely pants that had pockets and these don't have pockets so it throws me off it's cheap and then the material to me is not of very good quality the material looks um to be honest really cheap so i'm probably going to be sending these back i just picked up another pair of you know um faux leather trousers from another store um that's on the on its way and i think that will be of a better quality these are very thin um which is not bad for the fall because you know it's not um too cold during the fall it's, you just have your chilly days um but it is lined but the lining is just not thick at all these are in a size four extra large and they fit perfect don't get me wrong they fit perfect and I did decide to go up in sides um, and she in on bottoms just because I'm bottom heavy. And I never actually brought bottoms from them before. But this full extra large fits well, even to the point where I feel like I could have gone for a 3XL. I also decided to pick up these pants here. And to be honest, I actually got these pants because of the color you all should know. Purple is my favorite color. Um, so I decided to give these a try. And these are also a pair of straight leg. Well, these are not straight leg. These, to me, are kind of wide leg um, pants. Yeah, they're kind of like a wide leg pants. They fit you a little bit over the ankle. Um, the thing about these, which I thought I was going to love, and I like on the website, that it does have some pleating down the front of the pants and I love that whole pleating um, type of style that has um, really been catching my eye lately and I've been trying to find pants that fit me that I can get like a looser fit where you can actually see the pleating the only thing about these pants are they are very thin I'm um, just looking at them I can see through them now I'm not sure maybe because it's all these lights where it looks extra see-through um, 
I tried them on and I don't think they're that, that you know, you can get away with wearing them without seeing your panties. Um, the only thing is that these don't have pockets either. Um, and again, the material to me is very thin, very cheapish. Um, and also these came with a stain on them. Let me see, can I find that stain? Yes. Can you see that stain here? at the bottom of the pants yes it came with a stain on them so I definitely wasn't um, happy with that so I'm probably going to be sending these back as well um, yeah I'm probably going to be sending these back I would have kept these if they didn't have that stain but I feel like if I'm going to pay for something it should come in top condition it shouldn't come with any rips any holes any stains and anything because I could have made these work. I definitely could have made them work. Um, I could have threw on a blazer. I have a lavender color blazer that would have looked very pretty with those. But I'm definitely going to be sending those back. I have shown you two items that didn't per se work. But I may could have worked around them. Um, but I'm definitely going to show you now a few items that did work. Okay, so I've shown you two pieces that didn't quite work for me. Um, well, they actually weren't too bad. I think I probably could have got away um, with, with it if I styled it up really pretty, but I just don't want to have to go through all of that. Um, but I do want to show you some pieces that actually really work, pieces that I love. And the first one is this blazer here. I love this, you guys. I love, love, love it. Look at the dramatic puff sleeves on this blazer very adorable this is in a um, houndstooth print it does have a belt that goes with it um, where you can cinch in your waist if you would like that the belt has kind of like silverish um, detailing but it's not enough silver whiz though you'll feel uncomfortable when go because I am a go type girl um, the only thing about this is it is this isn't a 3 extra large I could have gotten away with um, getting it in the 2x but it's fine um, I'm not going to send it back. Now this, um, the arms are a little bit loose at the bottom. So I'm going to take it to my seamstress and have her kind of slim down the arm a little bit. It is lined, but it is a very light lined um, blazer. This is um, pretty good for the price. I think I may pay $30 for this blazer. It may have been cheaper. I will link these items down below because they are new items. Um, now, for this to be of a cheaper, um, well, not a cheaper, a low-end kind of um, low, low, low-end price store, you know, we kind of sometimes get those flimsy little blazers that's really not worth buying. I think this is a good one. Even though it is on the thinner side, it's not um, flimsy. It just looks kind of like you're wearing a shirt rather than wearing a blazer. I love this. I'm probably... Um, maybe also get my seamstress to add a shoulder pad here so the shoulder could be even more dramatic. But I definitely love this. I can't wait to wear this when the weather cools down a little bit. Something else that I'm really loving is this skirt, you guys. Mm -mm -mm. I love this skirt. I knew I would love it when I saw it on the website. The only thing is I when I saw it on the website, I was like, mm not sure because I'm very um, high in the back, in the back area of me. And I didn't want it to be too short in the back and kind of show my goods. But this is not too short. It's a perfect fit. And I think it's because of the sizing that I got. I got this in a 4 extra large. I definitely could have went down to a 3X, even maybe a 2. But I think the 4 extra large gave me enough space in the back so it wouldn't ride up and it wouldn't be too short this dress is adorable look how flirty and cute this is it has the whole ruching kind of paper bag waist that i love um it's pleated if you can see the pleats it's like those small um pleats and look at look at the you know the the texture and the design in this this is a um, plaid type of skirt it has the creams and the browns in the background this will be so lovely with a nice blazer a pair of over the knee boots well not over the knee boots knee high boots 
or even ankle booties but yes on the website they have this pair as like schoolgirl type of look and they have it with um, a blazer that I really loved as well. I think I'm going to go back and order that blazer. I was a little skeptical just because um, I don't, I'm, I, I'd be very kind of on the edge with lower end um, stores with their blazers just like I said in the last clip. Um, I don't like thin blazers. I like my blazers to be structured. So I may get that blazer just to try it out to see how well the quality it is. But from the quality of this skirt, I'm betting that that blazer that they had paired with this is of good quality as well. So another item that I'm really loving that I picked up as well from Shein are these leather shorts here. Um, I love these shorts. Now, I know they may not look um, probably much, just me holding it up and actually um they are kind of the same like material of the pants that i shown you early on but i think because they're shorts you can kind of get away with it now the thing about these are they are a little wrinkled so i probably should have steamed these out just a little bit um before i show them to you i love that they're high waisted um i love the belt that goes with it they um, have the cuff here at the bottom, which is very flattering. Um, I love the color of it. I have a pair of knee-high boots that would look lovely. Same color as the shorts. It would look so pretty together. Um, with probably like a long, a long line blazer would be nice with this with just a bodysuit underneath. I, I like it. I, I mean, the material is not perfect. But I definitely think I can get away better with these than the pants. Um, and these are also in a full extra extra large. Um, and I'm, I may, I'm, I have to tell you that these are a little bit on the shorter side. But I feel like being as though it's coming into fall, um, it's kind of boot season. So you may um, be able to wear like a knee high where you won't have too much leg out. As well as you can put on tights underneath or stockings. Um, just to make you feel a little bit more comfortable, but I'm definitely going to be rocking these and I'm not that much into short shorts, but I think I can work with these. I can get around with these. I really need to steam these out so I can really get the gist of um, how they would look on, um, but they were very wrinkled when I got them. So some of the wrinkles have fallen out with the, just them hanging up for like the last two weeks. But I do love these shorts. And again, this is from one um, their new fall collection as well. Okay, I did pick up a dress. And it's this here. I love this dress, you guys. I love, love, love it. I hope the light is not blurring it out. I think it's very, very pretty on my skin tone. I'm sorry, you guys. I'm looking over there. My computer is going off. Um, I think it's very pretty on my skin tone. It's a whole kind of paisley-like print. And then it's kind of have that Victorian neckline. I'm sorry. I think this is the belt that kind of goes around the waist. But I don't doubt if I'll be wearing that. Um, but it has the Victorian neckline. Let me button this for you. It comes up high at the neckline and then it has kind of like that ruffling at the top that's very um, much Victorian. Um, also has that around the wrist. Um, the only thing about it is it is kind of looser at the wrist. So I'm also going to get my seamstress to fit the, um, fix this as well. I want it tight around the wrist kind of like this um, top I have on now. Is. I do want it tight. I think... It will bring out more of the details on the wrist of this dress. The arms are sheer. Um, the the body part is kind of sheer, but it does have a lining underneath. Um, I still will probably wear a slip or maybe kind of like shapewear underneath just to make sure your goods are not out. I love the orange, the yellow. I love the length of the skirt. I thought that it was going to be a little short when I first got it in. But if it's perfect, this is in a size 3 extra large. Um, I would have not sized down. I probably, I like my dresses to be more flirty and kind of 
a little oversized rather than, than you know, kind of just fitting it a little tight. Um, I definitely would throw on a big chunky like brown belt to cinch in that waist. I wouldn't use that kind of cheapish tie around the waist. I would put on my own belt just to add a little bit, a little bit of character to this outfit. Um, this is very pretty and it's kind of like a paisley and flower print. It's just awesome. I can't wait to wear this. I definitely can't wait to wear this. Um, as soon as it gets cooler out, I will be <laughs> um, taking pictures in this at least. I love it. All right, my loves. Um, I have one more kind of dress. Um, well, this one is a shirt dress. And it is this dress here. I know it's probably a little washed out um, due to all of the bright lights. But this is the dress. It's a shirt dress. Um, matter of fact, let me turn down the light so you can see just a little better. Yes, this is it. It's a long shirt dress. And then it has some writing here on the right side. And it says, nobody is you and that is your power. Which is a lovely um, statement. Um, that's true. You know, no one is you. You are your own person. Um, I love that this is short sleeve and it has the cuff um, at the sleeve. Now, you can wear this as a dress um, if you wear the proper undergarment as far as like a slip underneath or shapewear or something because this is see-through. You will be able to see your goods through this. Um, I just say you can wear it as a dress. It is a shirt dress. Um, it does have slits on the sides, but I feel as though the slits come up um, a little high, but not high enough to where you can see your goods. But me, I'm just kind of like a modest type person. So I definitely will be wearing this as just like a long um, shirt dress but over top of something. Maybe um, some biker shorts or even kind of like a bodycon skirt and a pair of um, ankle boots. But I definitely wouldn't wear, wear this as a dress. But it is appropriate for people who do like to wear their shirt dresses. As dresses, you can get away with this one. I'm just the type, I don't really wear a lot of shirt dresses. The shirt dresses that I do have quite a few shirt dresses, but I don't wear them as shirt dresses. I kind of wear them as like tunic tops. Um, this would be very cute as well with just a pair of jeans and a pair of knee-high boots or a pair of jeans and a pair of pumps. Um, but I do love this. Even when it gets a little bit colder, um, when short sleeves, um, you need a little bit more than a short sleeve, this would be very pretty with a black roll neck underneath where you can see the black um, underneath at the arms as well at the um, neck part be very very cute um, I actually got the, got this or saw this on um, another youtuber or content creator page which is um, 10 ways to wear I love um, her hauls she pick up some nice things we don't have kind of like the same um, style we kind of she she likes a lot of bright colors I'm more of a neutral type girl um, and she likes she's more of street style I'm just more of kind of chic casual but her hauls are awesome it you know I get a lot of ideas from her channel um, so yeah head over to 10 ways to wear and see some of her videos child she is awesome so the last thing I'm going to show you is a stunner I love this I love it. I love it. And it is this two-piece set. And this is a long gingham print um, cardigan and pants set. These are the pants here. And this is the cardigan. It has the gingham print. And then it is lined in a thick black um, band around the, the trim of the cardigan. I love this. Y'all know gingham came back on the scene last fall winter you guys and they showed out so you were seeing gingham everywhere um this winter and it is coming back out this fall winter season so i'm lucky to get my hands on some this early on um she did a good job with this now i must say the pants don't fit me well and i think that's because I do have kind of like a higher um, behind so it kind of sits a little low in the back portion which I don't like um, and to be honest I would much rather have this with a solid black pair of pants anyway so I doubt if I wear 
the tights, but some people may love it as, you know, a two-piece set. I probably would just wear the cardigan. I knew that the pants probably was going to fit me a little ill will, but I still brought it just because of the cardigan, honey. The cardigan is lovely. This thing hits you maxi length. Yes, it does. It hits you maxi length. It has this whole little um, tie here where you can cinch it in the waist. Um, but, honey, you know your girl ain't doing that. Your girl is going to throw on a um, a nice belt, you know, just to belt it up, just to still cinch my waist in. Um, but I doubt if, you know, if I be wearing that. But I love this. I can't wait to wear this, you guys. I cannot wait to wear this. Gingham goes good with all colors, so you can do a pop of um, bright colors underneath of this cardigan, or you can do... Um, just your basic black or white top underneath either way. This is a stunner. I love it. Oh, so you guys, that brings me to the end of this video. I love just about all the pieces that I got from Shein um, during this haul. I can't wait to shop with Shein again. I hope this has inspired you to go check out Shein. Check out their website. See what you may like. And girl, put it in the bag because you can't go wrong with Shein. The prices are awesome. Most of their items, um, you you can kind of tell the how the quality, quality is going to be by reading the reviews as well as reading kind of the material, the materials that the items are made out of. Um, and the reviews are awesome because they'll tell you if something runs big, whether it runs small, how the quality is. Um, you definitely have to look at the reviews with each item and she in because their items kind of differ. You may have um, something that's, you know, the, the sizing is way different than um, a pair of pants, for instance, you know, you might pick up a pair of pants and the sizing um, is on point, but you might pick up something else and the sizing is like way off. So definitely do your research with the reviews and the comments, honey. But, um, girl, I'm loving this haul. All right, my loves. Make sure you thumbs up this video and comment down below. Tell me which outfit you like the best.